sometimes the bike starts good and sometimes it just gets stuck. The starter gets stuck. Let's see what happens. It's like random. Well, that time it was okay. Let's go down Main Street just because. Wait, where was that? Oh, shoot. No, that's the drawbridge. The drawbridge is up. Forget it. Oh, road is closed. Okay, I guess we're going elsewhere. <laughs> I've been behind the scooter for so long. Oh, why does the bike feel like it's gonna stall? Now oh, there's the scooter again. I just seem to be following him everywhere, don't I? Ooh, lane splitting. Look at him. <laughs> Would I lane split if it was legal? I don't know. Maybe. Yeah, I, I like doing it, like when traffic is stopped. When traffic's moving, I, I would. My only fear though is because it's not legal here and nobody really does it and it like people get mad and they'll try to run you over and stuff so that's... I'd be afraid to do it at first <laughs> until it becomes more... more known. Stop here for pedestrian. I'm not used to that. Doesn't the bike sound kind of cool now. I mean, not that it didn't before, but it's got that rumble now. And all I did was lower the idle a lot. By the way, I'm still using this thing all, all the time. Always. I love it. Even for just around the city, I love that thing. I can't do 30 in fifth gear. <laughs> I mean, I could force it, but at that point, it's just no, it's not good for it. Should we race the sport bike? I'm not gonna do that. That's crazy. I might be able to get the jump on him off the line if I was better. <laughs> I just, I'm not good with first gear. So this bike will do 35 in fifth gear, but not 30. <laughs> I can feel like I'm barely, I'm just giving enough throttle to keep the speed constant, but as soon as that speed gets around 30, it just, there's no power left. Of course, I give it more throttle and then it'll go, but it'll just be like, gug, 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 gug. <laughs> it'll just, it when, uh, there we go, 30. I'm still holding it the same, but it's slowly losing speed. It's slowly, slowly. Okay, I gotta slow down. <laughs> Do you have your left blinker on for a reason? Oh, there we go. I, I gotta hold the gas again because I'm <laughs> engine braking too quick to even reach the light. I should tell that other motorcycle he's got his blinker on. I just, I don't know if he's gonna understand what I'm saying to him. <laughs> wow, this place is busy. Busy. Oh, because it's like, it's a warm day out in winter. That's why. It's 78 outside. Everyone wants to go to the beach. Yes, cold weather. 50 degrees. Cold. Yes, I know. I'm not going to find a parking spot. I might just go elsewhere, really. Oop. Couldn't see past that car. I almost went. <laughs> I should back up a little. My tire's kind of sticking out. There it goes again. Getting under 35, it's struggling. Aw, I was going to keep it going. Then the light turned red. What'll happen? It'll just start going down and down and down until it reaches 30. And eventually I just have to downshift because there's no power. <laughs> I noticed some people have their mirrors like adjusted so far inward that I can't even imagine how they see me. Like this car right here. Don't know if you could tell, but its mirror looks like it's adjusted in. Like it's almost half folded in. How in the world would they be seeing me right now? Other than shoulder checking. That's abandoned. Holy cow, that that wall. Oh, there it is, 30. It's not going, gotta downshift. <laughs> even have to hit the brakes seriously cool well, we got Suzuki 
Jixer, is it a 750? Yeah, it's a Jixer. I love those bikes. Oh, is nobody allowed on the beach? Oh, wow, it's high tide. Holy cow, I just realized that. Look how high up it is. It's like totally not normal. It must be um, rip currents or something. So they have cones out, like... Oh, they don't have cones all the way down, just around here. That's strange. I don't see anybody, like, deep in the water or anything. I already forgot where I parked. <laughs> wow, that thing sits really high. I thought mine sat high. Dang. So see how that Honda Shadow sits? That first one over there? Look how mine sits. Oh, mine does sit kind of high-ish, doesn't it? Oh, wow. Mine actually sits lower than that Yamaha. Yes, I'm making a huge deal about how high it is off the ground. <laughs> I, to me, the higher off the ground, the better, because the more clearance you got for turning, right? The more you can lean it and turn it and not be afraid of scraping, right? I, that's what I think. Ooh, that was close. Almost just witnessed a stupid accident. weird there's just a very certain rpm where the bike hates it it's like near idle it's okay bike's doing pretty good with the slow idle i haven't stalled it it hasn't threatened to stall i'm pretty happy about it i think i'll keep it this way oh this just makes me want to go like 100 miles per hour down this ah, it's so open it's like a racetrack I smell burnt Pop-Tarts. I seriously smell burnt Pop-Tarts right now. <laughs> wow, if that big old semi-truck can make that U-turn, I don't know why other people can't. Still haven't hit the brakes, still haven't hit the brakes. First gear, still haven't hit the brakes. Now I'm hitting the brakes. <laughs> that was so cool. If you make that a habit, I think that would definitely save your brakes. Don't flick your cigarette out after you pass a motorcyclist. Really? Jeez, right after they pass me, they go flick their cigarette. People do that. I don't get it. It's like, are you trying to hit me? Trying to set me on fire? They, people just don't have, like, they just don't know any better. They don't even think of it. Spongebob! Stop flicking your stinging cigarettes at me. All these cars are hitting their brakes and I'm just like, huh? Let off the gas. Yeah, I'm kind of like bragging. I think it's cool. My engine brakes are better than your brakes. <laughs> Gosh, I don't know what I'm even saying here. Company vehicle, we drive the speed limit. Oh, let's let's test that. Let's see, I'm gonna follow them. Why do they have such a big exhaust pipe? Ooh, they took their dash cam down. They're gonna speed. Oh no, they're putting it back up. <laughs> good idea though. Dash cams are good. Oh, that's their GPS, Never mind. Oh, I don't know what anything is anymore. And they are driving the speed limit, that's for sure. Like, my thing says 50. I know that's actually 45 or so, but they're definitely driving the speed limit. And they're actually doing what the sticker says. Oh, nope, they're speeding up. Okay, 55, which is actually like 50. Yeah, they're still doing the speed limit. Even five over, that's probably considered doing the speed limit. But why would you have a sticker, like, bragging about that? I don't, I don't understand. Company vehicle, we drive the speed limit. Why? Like, why does that matter? They are going like exactly the speed limit because my thing, you know how a lot of motorcycles are, they show over what they're actually doing. 20 mile per hour when flashing. You can all get your speeding tickets. I'm slowing down. Don't rear end me, dude. And speeding fines are doubled. Oh, there's kids. Yeah. Do not stop on tracks. Good idea. <laughs> I don't think I want to. Some people might though, like, you know, the traffic's really backed up or something. Some people do it, maybe. 
wouldn't catch me doing it. I've seen enough of those movies where the trains just come out of nowhere and, you know, 